Hey guys, welcome to this week's Tuesday Truth. We're in a series called Lessons from Lockdown. Yeah, and I'm going to be talking this week from, from Matthew 7, 24 to 27. And let me get straight into it and read that ver- those verses to you so that we can kick this off. So Matthew 7, 24 to 27 says, Everyone then who hears these words of mine and does them will be like a wise man who built his house on the rock. And the rain fell and the floods came and the winds blew and beat on that house. But it did not fall because it had been founded on the rock. And everyone who hears these words of mine and does not do them will be like a foolish man who built his house on the sand. And the rain fell and the floods came and the wind blew and beat against that house and it fell. And great was the fall of it. So, I think for, for, for this, one thing that's really been on my heart during this time is the small things God's doing in our lives in this time and also the, the bigger things that He's doing within our lives and, one, and also the small things that have been taken away during this time. So, I'm going to use the good old faithful Jenga as an as a bit of a demonstration for this and and how I see it playing out in in my life and how I think that building our faith and our foundation on Jesus Christ can can help us through these times. So I'm going to use the the Jenga box builder thing. So this part over here, this is going to be the representation of Jesus Christ and the and the foundation in a rock. So imagine this is your foundation, building your foundation of your life on Jesus Christ and how he loves you. So he's going to hold you the whole time like this box is holding this Jenga. And each Jenga piece represents something different in your life. So this piece could mean, it could be your your physical appearance. So for me, this piece could rep- represent being a blonde guy with a beard, with a ponytail, big, I don't know, whatever my physical appearance is. And that's been placed there. This block over here could be my job and where I work and the people I come into contact with at work. Um, This could be something that happened to me while I was at school that has formed who I am today. So our lives are put together by a whole lot of different little blocks and small things that God has done within our lives. And it forms one big person or one big, in this point, a tower, but it forms who we are. So I think in this time, what I would like to represent is, I think for a lot of us, things have been taken away. So for you guys, school has been taken away. So we can take a block away from that. So school has been taken away or the school we knew has been taken away. Um, For others, work has been taken away. That means jobs, parents have lost their jobs, all these things. So a block has been taken away. Um, For a lot of people, they've just lost a lot during this time. And I think community as a whole, church, we've lost. So another block is taken away. Friendships have been put under strain. Relationships have been put under strain. So we take another block out. So... And as we keep taking blocks out, we, we seem to be making this, this tower a lot less strong. And as I take blocks away, but when we form our lives and our foundation on Jesus Christ, He holds these small things together. And no matter how hard life shakes and no matter how hard life gets, He's going to hold it together. This tower gets held together. And then as we get go on through life, I think it takes me back to, during this time, it takes me back to Job a lot, where Job lost everything, but his faithfulness to God and his faithfulness to understanding that God's plan is bigger, just held him together. And through that, his life was rebuilt. And I think that as we come out of this lockdown now, we're going to find our lives getting rebuilt and The pieces aren't going to go back to where they were. They're going to get put back on top. So school comes back. It's going to go to the top of you. Um, Work for your parents is going to come back. 
all the blocks that were taken out, all the small objects that were taken out during lockdown are gonna get are gonna get put back and we're gonna build our lives so much stronger. New blocks are gonna come into the picture and we're gonna be able to add them to our life and they're gonna they're gonna redefine our lives. And as the as the tower gets taller, as in Job, God's faithfulness to us and our faithfulness towards him is going to create a tower that is unshakable first because our foundation is on Jesus Christ. And yes, small objects have been taken out. But I think that due to our faithfulness, God is going to bring us up and he's going to build us up stronger and he's going to make us so much better through this time. So I think if I can leave you with anything is if you can build your life or build your foundation of life on Jesus Christ as this is in this in this Jenga blocks, I, th I feel like you're going to be able to weather any storm. And I think it's been proven during this time by so many, so many people have been affected by COVID-19. And so many people have just, they've had hard times hit during this time, but their faithfulness to God and their firm foundation on who Jesus Christ is and the, his, their understanding of who he is and what he's doing in their life has just kept them going. And now as we come out of this so-called lockdown we're in, I feel like we're just going to be able to be like Job and through our faithfulness, we're going to rebuild our lives and it's going to be, become so much bigger and so much firmer. And our towers are going to be become bigger and our lives are going to become stronger and we're just going to come back so much better and, and than we were before. So if I can just leave you guys with anything, I feel just just let Jesus control what's happening around you because we're in a time where control is of nothing we can do. We can't control what's happening around us. We can't control COVID-19. There's no cure. There's no vaccine. But if we understand that Jesus Christ knows what's happening, God knows what's happening. He's already foreseen the outcome of COVID-19. I feel like we're going to be able to come out of this so much stronger like Job came out of his his um situation so much stronger our faithfulness is going to bring us back so much stronger so i just through this time i feel we need to just remember who our foundation is built on and who we are and how we can build further towards who to be more like jesus and yeah so i feel the small things in our lives, we might think they don't matter, but to God, we are built up of small things that make a big thing. And everything God does is to build us up stronger and to make us better. So just like this Jenga, this Jenga, let's build our lives on who, who God is and let's have little shaky areas with, where, where the bricks have maybe fallen or things have been taken away from us. But instead of looking at that as a, destruction moment let's look at it as a building forward to a bigger tower so that our towers can become bigger and firmer and stronger even though there's a bit of shakiness in it yeah so i hope that this this helps you guys to to understand uh, your or god's faithfulness towards you yeah and i'll see you guys on friday i hope that you have a wonderful youth day this week and that your week at school, if you're back at school, is great. And if you're not back at school, your week on, on Zoom school is also great. Thank you for listening. Have a good week.